dude what's up guys sorry i didn't see you guys there um but since you guys are here i figured uh we're gonna open up a little bit of uh evolving skies and we're gonna throw a little bit of it too um <laughs> man it sounded like one of them really went kind of far away um let me grab this real quick uh Go and where'd the other one go? What? Alright, yep, got it. Sucker's really lost. Hang on. <laughs> Alright, got it, y'all. <laughs> My bad. Forgive me. But we are back to five Evolving Skies packs. And I almost lost the one Eevee one, so I'm glad I was able to retrieve it because this is an Eevee set, so I'd probably just be nothing but bad juju right off the bat you know what i mean throwing eevee so now i think about it, i wonder if that's why i have such bad luck in this set dude because i always forget the the eevee promo because you can see which promo i'd i'd like a little more <laughs> i love this thing man it's so daggone cute i think i have one in my backdrop over here but today guys this may be one of the last times i ever open evolving skies and that is because i've opened man let I haven't even opened that much of this, and the little bit that I did open is has been very uneventful. I've only, I'm only somewhere like between thirty, like thirty five packs probably, maybe maybe upwards of forty, and I have yet to pull any kind of full art from the set. Nothing with texture have I pulled. I could man, it's I pulled crap, man. Like I pulled crap. I pulled like two V's, and they weren't even cool V's. They were whack, like. Oh, man, I don't even I don't even know. They were that that eventful. That I don't even remember them. So, anyways, guys, let's just flip y'all around. I don't want to hold you guys too much longer. Let's crack open these packs. Let's see if we can finally pull some textured juju buju. You know what I mean? I really hope so, man. If we can just pull something nice, dude. Help me, help me restore some faith in evolving skies. And also, I had the person that worked there pick these out for me. I did not pick them out this time. So that is a whole nother factor that. Hopefully it will come into play and, and work to my advantage and, and <laughs> change some of this bad luck around. So, let's get you guys flipped around. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Oh, whoa, almost forgot. Guys, if you could hit that subscribe button, I would sincerely appreciate it. I would love for you guys to follow my journey, join my journey, and I'd love to come on you guys with yours. So, please hit that subscribe button. Help your boy out. We're on the road to 1K. Any day you know what to say, you can even ask my bae or my boy Jay, and they'll tell you exactly as I say. So, all right, let's flip you around. And all right, ladies and gents, there we go. The good old-fashioned signature card throwdown. All right, let's get some of these cards out of the way here. I brought some new uh, cards to for your viewing pleasure, just so you guys can can get a different change of scenery and 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 that allows me to go through my cards and pick some cards out and gives me a reason to well just do anything with them so first up i got my psa 9 uh base set 2 charizard bought that on even myself graded it and uh you guys would have seen that in my 15 card psa 10 charizard return well they weren't all psa 10s I, but i got some really good psa 10s but i got some really cool nines too like this one as well PSA 9 Dark Charizard, the beautiful dark blue midnight sky, <laughs> hollow pattern, and we'll just put that right by the Team Rocket Pack, sorry Aaron Rodgers, rookie, and then I have this guy here too, boom, CGC 2 Charizard, I was going for a 1, but CGC gave me the 2, you can see that bad boy is folded right in half down there in the middle, 4 way, and uh yeah that's just because i i love all charizard especially base sets in all grades because i feel like they would all have an, uh, ama an, an, an amazing story to say all right so enough about that we only got five packs so the opening part won't uh be too 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 long and uh where can i put these and they're kind of a bad shape all right i'm gonna set them off to the side but i'll open them right here with you guys actually let's see back up a little bit more all right okay and code card for you fine ladies and gentlemen Ooh, that one popped right out all right nice hopefully nice and hopefully it doesn't mean that it's all beat up let's see how this one looks um i know it's just a promo and i have a lot of these but 
out of all of them that I've opened, it's I, I can't say I got like a perfect condition one. Even this one, it looked amazing up until. You can see, I'm trying to get the right lighting on for you guys. Right up here, you can kind of see a little nick. Oh, but the rest of it looks so good. I know it's not a crazy card, but I just, I love the card. You know, I love the way the card looks. And you know what they say. Or, well, what I'm going to say. And a lot of people say, collect what you like, man. And I really like that card. I think it's freaking adorable. All right. So let's proceed with what they need, ladies and gentlemen. And if you guys, if this is your first time here, I would like to, one, welcome you. And thank you. Thank you for stopping by. My name is Nick It Nick. And I'm just a Pokemon collector and uh, started this YouTube channel um, just because I, I just wanted a way to connect with the community. And I'm always on YouTube watching other people's stuff. And, uh, you know, just whenever I, whenever I pull cool cards, I just wanted to share the moment with other people. And then not, you know, hold it all to myself. Nick it! We got us a hit. Well, that's like the only hit we got in the last opening, too. <laughs> I just wanted to share my journey with you guys and just be able to have somebody to talk to and, and, and communicate with and just talk uh, talk shop with. Pinsir! Let's see. Damage from your single strike Pokemon attack isn't affected by your opponent's active Pokemon's resistance. Okay, interesting. All right. So nothing too uh, eventful there, to say the least. The pincer is cool, though. It'd been cool to get in like a reverse hollow. All right. Code card. Let's see how this promo is coming. I won't look at them all. If I have to pop them out and stuff, I'll probably just save that so you guys don't have to endure all that. Oh, I did it anyways. Couldn't help it. <laughs> Here's the code for that. I think I showed that. Let's see. Yep, see Nick in the exact same spot. And not the kind of Nick, you know what I mean? Like me, Nick, you know, not, not a good Nick like that. That's a bad Nick. All right. Here we go. Got the beautiful Sylvia on the back. So beautiful. So pretty. Yeah, just, man. Thank you guys for stopping by. How have your guys' luck been on Evolving Skies? Because I, I told you how mine has been, which has just been horrible. Une uneventful. Not, not, not so much fun. Luckily, I collect Master Sets, so right now, when you first open a set, it's like you need everything, so it's not that bad. But come on, man, everybody likes to pull some heat, right? You know what I'm saying? Like that. Not like that. That would have been cool, though, if it really was, if it was something. All right, pack numero. Pack number three. And let's see, is this card out? Yes, it is. How does this one look? Nick up here. Man, they're all so close, dude. Why is the top even nicked like that? If anything, it should be the sides where it sits in the daggone thing. You know what I'm saying? That's all right. I'm going to put it in my binder that I just, that I've been, or that I'm working on creating. Um, of just a whole bunch of cards I like, singles that are sitting anything in like just, you know, hard cases sitting around like that. It's going in this binder. Or anything that's been my PC sitting in top loaders or card saver or anything like that. I'm going to take it out, put it in this binder, and just have a binder of just in insane, incredible hitters. And I'll let you know how that's going. All right, digging gloves, palpitoed, crustal, rufflet, drowsy, flabebe, rock and roller, that guy geeter, crustal ant. Man, dude, this is rough, dude. <laughs> you think I'm opening up some fusion strike or something? See, they're saying the fusion strike pull rates are, they think pull rates are getting bad now. To me, man, it feels like pull rates have been bad. They've been hard. It's been tough. Oh, snap. Oh, snap, whizzle, drizzle. Okay. We may have us a contender on our hands there. Ooh, baby. All right, all right. We got a little swirl. Is that a swirl down there in the bottom? A little one? All right, I'll put the card down. The free 20-cent promo. I'm sorry, guys. I, I, I love the card. I got to keep this one separate. I'll put it over here. I'm going to block those amazing specimens of Pokemon history. Come on, man. Just one textured. The only good cards I got from this set are some cards that I bought from, uh, <laughs> or I traded and or bought from these 
little kids that in this area that buy some Pokemon cards where I got these from. I'm happy they get them, but dude, they pull fire, bro. From they get them from Nick it, they get them from the same place. Eevee, they get them from the same place. But it's probably pretty cool that they actually have somewhere they can go, and I'll show them like what it costs online, and then I'll trade them either other cards they want, or a lot of times they want sealed product, you know, because their kids do. They're just pack rippers, so they pull some fire, show their friends at school, and then they're ready to go on to the next one. All right, this is my last chance, man. Come on. Here's the AV. This is so whack, bro. Why does it gotta be like this? It doesn't have to be like this, man. Here's a little Eevee promo since it's the first one I'm opening out of in this opening. Eh, not too bad. It's a little nick on top, but cool promo nonetheless. Gotta always love an Eevee. Can't hate. Can't be a play hitter. Be a participator. Come on, man. I gotta get something, dude. This is like the last 25 openings I will have just gotten nothing. Lantern. Treasure energy. Hopefully there's some treasure in this pack. Digging gloves. Let's continue to dig. Mareep the sheep. Woba fat. Waba. Love this. Dweeble the weeble. Hippopotatatawanimus. Tentacruel. And... Cresselia Gold, Mother Trucker, let's go! Yes, dude! <gasps> oh, thank goodness, dude! Oh, faith has been restored, bro. Faith has been restored. Bro! How much is this card going for? Wow. I pulled, I pulled some gold. I did what I was told, and I pulled some gold. Cresselia, bro. Search your deck for one second energy card. Attach to one of your Pokemon if you go if you go second and it's your first turn. Instead of search for up to three psychic energy, attach them to one of your Pokemon, then shuffle your deck. Photon laser for two psychic energies. You have if you have at least five energy. My bad folks. Future Nick here. I don't know what happened to the video. Uh just cut out all of a sudden and didn't realize, so I don't know how long I was talking to myself exactly, but uh, fast forward a little bit. Here's the Cresselia that we pulled. She's looking clean in all her glory. And I put it in my binder along with some of my other, uh, um, what you call it, Evolving Skies cards with this Aroma Lady that I pulled um, with and some other packs, actually, <laughs> right after this one um, with, uh, with, with my fiancé. So. And then, let's see, I acquired this one at some point in time, Leafy on VMAX. And what else do I got in here? Lespion. And uh, Flurry on VMAX. So there you go. There's some of my cards. Thank you all for tuning in. Y'all have a good one. Don't forget, I'd love it and appreciate it if you guys hit that subscribe button down below. I'd love for you guys to join my journey and I'd love to follow yours as well. Y'all have a good one. This is your boy Nick It Nick signing out. Peace.